In Hindu mythology, the Brahmastra, I-A-S-T, Brahmastra, is an astra, weapon, that is said to be able to destroy the whole universe, capable of destroying creation and vanquishing all beings. It is one of the most destructive, powerful, and irresistible weapons mentioned in Hinduism. It was created by Lord Brahma along with its more powerful variants Brahmashirsha Astra, Brahmanda Astra and Bhagavastra. It is termed as a fiery weapon that creates a fierce fireball, blazing up with terrible flames and countless horrendous thunder flashes. When discharged, all nature including trees, oceans, and animals tremble, and the sky surrounds with flame, glaciers melt and mountains shatter with copious noise all around. When used, the Brahmastra which is person-centric can destroy a powerful enemy if he does not possess an alternate counter-weapon. If it is Brahmashirsha Astra it causes collateral damage to every useful resource in a given area and prevents even a single blade of grass from ever growing in that area again. It is mentioned in Epic that there will be no rainfall for 12 Brahma years, 12 Brahma years equals 37. 32 trillion human years, and climate conditions will worsen. The strike of the Brahmashirsha Astra will eventually destroy everything. When Ashwatthama hurled the Brahmashira Astra against Arjuna, the Pandava countered by invoking the same weapon. To prevent widespread destruction Narada and Vyasa stood between the two Astras, ordering the two warriors to withdraw their weapons. Arjuna, out of nobility, did so. Ashwatthama, however, out of anger refused to recall the Astra and rather directed it to Uttara's womb to kill the unborn Pariksha in an attempt to produce some level of damage to his opponents. Closing parenthesis. The origin of the word comes from the word Brahma, who is the creator in Hindu culture. The idea that Brahmastra is the most powerful weapon can be understood by the kind of weapons that were used according to Hindu culture. The tree Murti, which consists of the three main gods, Brahma, Vishnu and Shiva, each wielding an astra, have them according to their characteristics. The primary and personal astra of Shiva is a Pashupatastra. It is one of the six Mantramukta astra which when unleashed cannot be stopped. Only three people in written texts have the power and capability to wield it. Brahmashi Vishwamitra, Sri Ram and Arjun. Lord Shiva has never used it against a lesser mortal or on any worldly entity. Also it has been a crime to use it in the current iteration of the universe. The personal astra of Vishnu is Narayanastra. It is also one of the six Mantramukta astra which when unleashed cannot be stopped. However unlike Pashupatastra one can pray to this astra for forgiveness and the astra may stop. One of the astra of Brahma is the Brahmashirsha astra which has the power to eliminate the existence of anything from the past, present and future. This astra can remove an entity's existence from this Brahma cycle. A more common usage of a lesser powerful astra is Brahmastra. Most often, a Brahmastra would be a weapon with insurmountable capabilities, far surpassing any other weapon used during any war or event. Most often the astra has been used by its wielder to destroy an extremely powerful enemy. Most of the Brahmarishas were capable of wielding it. Sri Ram, Karna, Arjun also had strong capability of using this astra.